We are group number 30, and it's a wireless charger for electric vehicles. Basically, the principle behind the design is having two uh, coils magnetically uh, coupled to produce a flux between them. So when you uh, add a voltage on the transmitter, uh, through the flux, uh, the voltage and current is induced on the secondary. So it's basically like a tra transformer without the iron core, it's just a gear gap. And what we, uh, our ideal design is to transmit uh, one, or, yeah, one kilowatt per 20 centimeters. So what we have measured out here is 20 centimeters, which is about the average of electric vehicle heights. So that's what we optimized it for. And you can see, uh, instead of an actual battery, we, we're using a uh, resistive light, light bulb load just to show you for a demonstration. But our ideal uh, resistance would be up in 600, 500, 600 grams. So we'd, we'd have a lot more voltage and current, but for the demonstration, we're using low, low voltage. So uh, we're getting, when we did it testing in the lab, we're, we're getting about 80% efficient, which is it's pretty good, but if we simulated it on, on the computer, we should get up to like 92%. So as you can see, by the light, the light bulb gets dimmer. So that just shows how if you misalign the two pads, that the efficiency will go down. So right now we have no way to like, to test how much the efficiency goes down when you misalign them. And that's something we plan on doing in the future. So we need some way, if we were to uh, market this uh, product, we would need some way for in your garage for you to have like some sort of docking kit to where you line up perfectly every time so it has the optimal charge. Yeah, where are you going? That's basically it. We've added, we added ferrites and aluminum. The ferrites are to write the flux to the middle. So no flux is lost like out here on the side, it's all between the two pads, so that helps us increase efficiency. Also just for safety reasons, in the exam, if you're uh, sitting on around it, you won't get any, you don't have to worry about it being hurt. Yeah, that's the, the aluminum vacuum plate like uh, contains the flux, so like if you have, if you're up here, you know, you're not going to be affected by the magnetic range.